What's up guys, New Doomsday here, and today we're back again. In this match we're going to be playing some Weapon Power Blackfeather in the bot lane. And I was finally able to get my hands on Blackfeather. He's been getting banned the past like few months in every single ranked match, so... This is the first time I'm playing him in a very long time. But we'll see how this works out. So it looks like we're going to be laning against probably Kestrel or Kane. We'll see which one. And that's alright, Blackfeather does really well into ranged ADCs. Especially once you reach level 6. You can 1v1 him super easily. But another thing that people really underestimate about Weapon Pro Blackfeather is... He's super strong against melees. Like, people don't realize it, but Blackfeather can hold his own against heroes like Gromshaw Lance, and he's the only melee that can really do that consistently. Oh, looks like it's a Magnus. It's an interesting matchup. I have never had that before. Okay, we'll see how this works out. Ooh, can I get these last hits? What? How did I not get that? Dang, my ability does no damage to these minions early on. I just can't get stunned up by this Magnus. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna stand off to the side of these minions. I'm not gonna stand right on top of them. That way, if he uses his B ability, he's gonna have to target me or the minions. Okay, so see how he tried to hit me? Now he didn't get the procs on the minions with his perk. So that's gonna make his wave clear slower. But like, if I stand right on top of the minions, he can try and hit me and the minions at the same time. So even if he does miss me... He can, um, get wave clear speed, which I don't want to give him, of course. Okay, there's his flask. I, I still have my own flask. I can win this, I have my A ability. Nice. Okay. One thing that people also don't really expect out of Black Feather is your A ability is an execute. The more health the enemy is missing, the more damage it's going to do. Also, I got my stacks from my perk on him with my B ability and my auto attacks. So that made it do even more damage. So like... Yeah, you definitely don't want to go for low health trades against the Black Feather because the A ability will chunk you like crazy. Yeah, that's why I try to get in as many auto attacks as I can before I use my A ability. Because I want to make sure I did enough damage to kill him right away. And then right when I got super low, I just executed. And I was able to just lead him. But yeah, I can get a heavy steal in boots with the shop, so that's a pretty good first shop. And also, the support y'all have been showing the past few weeks is crazy. I think the growth I've had is like the most I've had like an entire year. It's pretty insane, but yeah, we're super close to 5,000 subs. I think we can get it with this video. So... Anyways, we'll get back onto this healer. Oh, whoa, there's a glaive here. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's on the gold oak. Okay, Grumshaw's coming. We can at least get him off of it. No, we can't really. I'm not going to waste boots or anything chasing him. Oh, he's, he's going back around. He's going back to the gold look. Yeah, what is... Grumtron needs to rotate there. I don't think he realizes he was going back to the gold look. I, I couldn't rotate or else I was going to miss so many minions. Yeah, the gold look's gone. See, like, now that I have the wave advantage, he really can't bully me that much. Like, any damage he does, I'm pretty much just going to regenerate off these last hits. He won't be able to focus me and the minions at the same time. So that's good. Oh, somebody else is there. We should fight this, for sure. 
You definitely can win this. Oh, I never mind. They backed off. Okay, I'll let him have that. Nice. Okay, so I got my Serpent's Mess now. Now I should be able to... I'll be completely fine in lane. I want my healer now. Okay, nice. He even left me that. It's fine. This is pretty important because it gives you XP levels, stuff like that. A little bit of extra gold. See, so yeah, that wave is in a really weird spot. Uh, I'd oh, is he trying to... He's trying to freeze the wave. Okay, is that how we want to play Is that how... What's he wants to... Okay, never mind. I'm just going to freeze this on him now. I'm just going to let this shove onto my half of the map, and then I'm just going to hold it there. If that's, what he, if that's what he wants to do. I'm fine playing that game. Yeah, I, I regen any damage he does to me at this point, because I've got my Serpent's Mask. It really doesn't matter how many abilities he lands on me. I could just regen off all these minions. <laughs> He's trying so hard to last hit. But I'm not letting him. Whenever a minion goes low, I just try and step up and then force him off. I gotta clear some of these minions, actually. The wave is too big right now. That's gonna shove into my turret if I don't clear some. But you see, it's much harder for him to farm. If I just hold this around like this. See, now that the wave is in the middle of the map, there's nothing he could do. Where is it? He's gonna use his V ability. Where is it? Yeah, that's not happening. I probably didn't need a flash there. That was pretty excessive. So yeah, once that wave goes onto your half of the map, if you're holding the freeze, like, there's nothing they could do. But you don't want to always just freeze. Like, I knew I could freeze because I have such a big advantage with Blackfeather versus Magnus. Like, if he steps up and I get onto him, I can just completely demolish him. So yeah, look at how many minions he just missed because of that. He has, now he has the least amount of gold on his team. He just missed, like, a handful of waves. Yeah, he had a good idea. He was trying to hold it underneath his, like, right next to his turret. That way he could farm without the worry of being bullied, but... The wave was pushing back to me, so... I could actually do my own freeze. Now, the only thing you have to be careful of when you are freezing is the enemy jungler. Because if they rotate on you when you're freezing and the enemy has a bigger wave, they can push your turrets. We should for sure go for this. Oh, wait. Okay, okay, nice. I thought... I ulted too late. Or too early, I meant. We should be able to clean this guy up. Nice. That was good. Okay, I hate how I can't unless at this point. Nice, okay, I got it. Without taking terror shots. That's a really annoying thing with melees. When you can't last hit without taking terror shots. Yeah, the Magnus just went to mid lane. <laughs> I'm gonna go and check if their jungle is up. If these backs are up, that'll be nice. Oh, Glaive's here. No, I'm not really too worried. Uh, I can't really... Yeah, I can't gank mid. He's just gonna go invisible and then just retreat to his turret. That's a pretty hard gank to get off just by myself. Unless I had other teammates helping me. Like stunning him up and stuff. If Ilva was with me, for sugar for this. I can't. I, I don't. Our Vox is in top lane, so I guess I'm defending mid. Yeah, they still have everything up. Oh dang! I'm out of here. Okay, well I guess I'm just holding mid. Uh, well, is there a Vox just chilling in top lane? Oh gosh, I'm almost dead. Yikes. 
Oh, dang, that was kind of close. Yeah, that Vox was, I don't know what he was doing, but... He was just taking top wave, I guess. That was an awful ult. <laughs> Okay, I saved my turret. No, I don't think I could save it. Oh no, I ulted too early. Dang. Dang. I was trying to ult right as soon as the afterburn ran out, but I was just like a second too early. Ooh, I can go for that now. I can actually go and get myself some boots and then rotate there. Actually, they're all leaving now. Never mind. I'm gonna go and check if their backs are up. Mm, Glavis here again. That's fine. I'll just try and take one and then leave. Oh no, I was too slow on my ult. Ah, uh, please save me. Lance. Maybe. Nice, okay. Wait, Lance was one shot. <laughs> I didn't know he was one shot. I wouldn't have pinged. Oh, dang, Kane is here. No, I'm dead. Dang, that was a good rotation by Kane. I didn't expect him to come. Rip. Okay. <laughs> I guess that was nice of the Lance to try and save me. I didn't realize he was like... Like, less than a fifth of his health. Or else he probably shouldn't have came. That was definitely my bad for overextending. If I didn't get afterburn there, if I would have been fast with my ult, I would have been fine. Dang, that cane is fed now. In my opinion, Kane is probably still like the best bot laner when ahead. Like before the whole community edition started, and ranked Kane was definitely the strongest bot laner, especially if they would just hyperfeed him and stuff. And you could just melt, like, just completely delete health bars. Like, but I've never played Kane in a ranked match before, so I really have no idea how to play him. He's a pretty high skill cap brawler, or, how do I say brawler? I meant hero. hero. I've been playing too much Brawl Stars lately. But he's been, he's pretty high skill cap hero. So you definitely need some practice on him if you want to be really good with him. Let's see if we can get him. We got three people here. Oh, dang, the Ilva just revealed himself. Uh, no. We cannot do this. Yeah, I don't... This is not a good spot. I was thinking we could have caught him by surprise. If Ilvo could have gotten a burst onto him. Ooh, he's going around. Oh, we should... Oh, wait, he's back. Oh, use your B ability. No. Okay, never mind. Too late now. Oh gosh, I'm butchering all my B abilities. Nice, we got the kill. Oh, get me out of here. Oh wait, that landed. Dang, it's CP Kestrel. No wonder that got me. Yeah, CP Kestrel has longer range than weapon power with the arrows. Dang, looks like we're all missing our skill shots right now. But yeah, back there, if Ilva would have used their B ability and then gone for the stun, because the B ability is, has longer range than the stun on the A, so by using their B ability, they could have gotten onto him and then landed the stun. Yeah, we still got the kill anyway, so that's fine. Yep, I know. I'm just hoping clear. And that's gone. Oh, whoa, what the? Oh, nice steal. I was not expecting that. Ooh, I can go and clean this up. I can ult through this, I'll be fine.
thing. I really need boots. Without well, boots, it's kind of hard to stick onto them. And they have a bunch of CC and burst. Okay. But yeah, even though I'm low, there's really no point in recalling. Recalling right now would be a waste, since I could just regen off these minions, and I could split push at the same time. So I should at least be able to get one turret. Staying mid would have just been asking to die, because Kane could have just executed me. Yeah, they're all dying right now. But at least I can get a turret and get back to full health. This. Yeah, Black Feather's kind of an interesting hero. Since it's always banned and stuff, Weapon Power Black Feather is it's pretty good. It's, I'd say, the most well rounded hero out of all the bruisers. Because, like, he can split push, he can team fight, but he's not the best in, like, any one category, in my opinion. Hmm. I thought I could catch somebody rotating. Like, for split pushing. Heroes like Glaive would be better. For team fighting, you got like Kensei. Mmm, this Kane here. He's gonna he's really annoying. Uh no, not the dive I'm looking for. Yeah, that was definitely not the move. So many Grumptros make that mistake, they just dive in super recklessly. Even though we're clearly are not ready to dive. We don't even have our entire team here. Oh gosh. Now I gotta try and defend this maturit. Oh, I can't save it. Wait, oh crap, I just screwed up. Yo, that burst is insane. See, that's why that's why Kane is like the best ball laner still in my opinion. If you're good with Kane, he's still such a monster. Yeah, they gotta chill. So as I was saying, Blackfeather is probably like the West well-rounded bruiser, but I definitely do not think Weapon Power Blackfeather like is OP or anything. Now CP Blackfeather, CP Blackfeather is just straight up broken and should be deleted. Like it's just such a good hero. Yeah, but let's see if we can get some cleanup on these kids. Oh, uh, there's probably a trap somewhere. Yeah, I'm not gonna... I gotta be careful. Oh, can he land an impil? Oh, he didn't even go for it. Dang. If he could have landed an impil there, I probably could have killed him. Whoa, that almost killed me. So yeah, I definitely do think... It's definitely a strong pick, Weapon Power Black Feather, but... I don't think it's necessarily broken. Oh, I thought Vox was gonna take that wave. <laughs> they ran right to it and then just left it. What was the point of that? Well, I'm not complaining, I guess. So I can finally get my bone soul. Dude, honestly, I don't think I've said this, like, ever, but... Well, I probably have, but... I rarely say this, but I honestly need a husk before I can, like, team fight. Because this cane is just gonna melt me every single team fight. Like, I need to finish my bone saw and then get my husk, and then te and then we should be looking to fight. Because we're also, I'm just going to burst it down right away. I almost never buy husk, but I think in certain situations it's definitely a fantastic item. Yeah, they're already fighting up in top lane. I don't know why they're fighting without me and, me and Ilva, but I guess if they want to do that, I'll let them do that. And I'll just pull push ball lane. They're probably getting, yeah, they're getting ghosting right now. Or, no, they already... No, we have Ghostwing. Wait, what? We got Ghostwing. I don't even realize. Whoa, we got Ghostwing. Okay. Yes, yeah, so Kane just recalled. Ooh, there's Magnus here. Yeah, I'm not getting stunned up by that. Yeah, 
Ooh, who else? Kestrel. Dang, I don't think they saw us. Okay. I really want to catch... If one of them walks through this bush... Oh, I don't have a cam. Okay. Get me out of here. Are they really going to chase me? They are. Yeah, they can't kill me. I've not got my entire team here. Okay, I'm gonna just clean this adagio. Yeah, see, this Grumshaw is just diving in alone again. We should be able to get this cane here. That's a great impale by Lance. Yeah, there's a trap there. Hmm. Oh no, I missed that. Nice, okay, I'm still able to get it. Let's see, I still got my boots off cooldown. If he does try an afterburn me, I'll boots out. Oh, he didn't even afterburn me, he afterburned the Vox. Oh, stun- oh dang, the Ilva ended the stun. Okay, that's still fine. Oh no, I accidentally wasted my ult. I should be fine, I can get my barrier. Oh no, I'm not fine. Dang, that cane got me. Please, no, 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 do not do that. Okay, no. Maybe they could turn that around? Okay, that was a good stun. No, why are they focusing the Adagio? Get the cane. Nope, never mind. Yeah, they can't chase that. See, like, if we dive in as a team and we get, like, a stun off with Ova onto the cane, then we can, like, easily just destroy him, but we just need our team's help to stun him up and stuff. Yeah, I don't know why they both recalled. Now we're just pretty much giving him a free Black Claw. That's just free gold for them, really. I guess we got one turret, which is alright. I actually think I can 1v1 this Black Feather now. I should, or not the. I can't 1v1 myself. I think I can 1v1 this game now. I should be able to. If I can get him to like burn his B ability or boots first, I can easily just get him. I'm actually trying to go for this armory here. Oh, somebody's there. I know they're about to start fighting. Once they start fighting, I'm gonna just go for the armory. I think I can- I might be able to end even. If they don't see me. Yep, they're starting to fight. Couldn't just go for this. Oh, the cane's already recalling. Mmm, cane's coming back. Yeah, I can't end. I'm gonna just dip. Oh, I'm gonna have to try and turn on this. Oh, can I get him? No! Oh my gosh, I actually... Dang, if I would have stutter stepped upwards, I think I would have been fine. I might have been able to get that kill, I'm not sure. That was fine, at least I was able to get the cane. And the... Kestrel, like, burned everything. Next. This guy's gotta chill. They need the Ilva. They need to cut back to the Ilva. Nice. Okay, that was a good turnaround. Really, it's just the cane that's causing us problems. I don't know. They can end. I mean, I got the bot lane armory. Uh, why are they getting another armory? Just end. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna have to do it myself. This cane's about to come in here and delete him. Okay, yeah. I think that's about it. We should be able to end here. So that's gonna be it for this match. 
Weapon Power Black Feather I definitely think is one of the stronger bruisers. And it is pretty well rounded. You can pretty much use it for anything. Like I used it for split pushing, 1v1ing. You could team fight a bit on it too. So anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, share with your friends. And hopefully I can get a CP Black Feather match sometime soon to just show you all how broken the CP path is. It's pretty absurd. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one.